Right, we're just going to have a quick run through of what I use for bike camping. I've got me Cannondale Cadex. It's loaded up. Um, I've got two Altura bags on the back and I've got a front Ortlieb top opener which uh, I carry. I've got me Canon G7X in there which is ideal for this type of game. I've got me water filter and my bladder. I've got the fuel for me stove. It's got a little first aid kit, just a, a cap. I've got me reading glasses in there and I've also got my Cita Summit titanium spoon. Just me helmet that I normally have. Carry me sunglasses in this top pocket and I have some little self-adhesive puncture repair and a couple of zip ties, a bit of tissue, a bit of pieces. Right, so I carry the pole. This is for the shelter that I'll be using. If I'm either using the uh, Six Moons Designs Lunar Solo, I need a pole. Or if I'm using my me, me tarp, which is in that yellow bag, I still need a pole. Got a little tripod on the back. Two water bottles, just a normal one here. This one's a filtered one, so if you come across a stream along route, top it up, top that one up, you know, and you've got a handy water supply. Got a little pump on there. Got a rear light, I've got a front light, but it's obviously no good, but you can move it about if you needed to. But I don't plan to be riding about too much in the dark, but if you get caught out, it's handy. Just a little waterproof, lightweight shower type jacket. I have my uh, little sit mat. Just got a hat, it gets cool on a night. That's just like a little ground sheet that I use underneath the shelter. Always bring a down jacket with us, it does get cold on a night. It's just a lightweight synthetic type one pair of gloves, you never know. The bivvy bag just gives you that extra bit of warmth if you're in like a spring sort of camp and it's a bit cooler. Here we go, power bank. Um, got my head torch, power bank cables. Enough for an overnighter. Then my toiletry bag here, toothbrush, toothpaste some ibuprofen and stuff like that. This is my little cook system, the little storming cone in a Alp kit mug. Ideal for this cycling, camping. And that's my food bag, dehydrated meals. I've got a cup in there. I've got enough stuff to last two and a bit days, I would say. Right, and I've got Toolkit for the bike, spare tube, some bits of tissues and bits of zip ties and stuff like that. And on this other bag, so this is the shelter, the Six Moons Designs Lunar Solo. You've all seen that, and the pegs for that one. I've just got another dry bag here with just got some like uh, toilet roll bag, my little spade. I just got a buff and my hat that I usually wear for sleeping in. Just got my little cascade table. That uh, really lightweight. And then I've got me my sleep mat pillow, liner, and the, the bag for blowing up the sleep mat. And finally, I have, oops, the Rab Neutrino 200. It's like a summer bag, this one, lightweight. It's about five, uh, 565, 665, something like that. But uh, 
and that is is everything really. There's nothing more in there. No. That's it, and these all these come off and I normally put these in the tent or in the the porch area of the tent on an evening so nobody can nick them. But yeah, and that's basically my setup for bike camping. Thanks for watching. Yeah, I forgot to add that I uh, also may be bringing along a pair of sort of trousers, walking trousers, and a, like a fleece top for the night time, uh, and a change of underwear and socks.